Hello! He oh, wow. Sub, sub, sub. Oh, my God, guys. Are we, are we actually starting this stream? We're starting this stream reading a load of text. Okay, well, you, you've you done it. I mean, I what do you want me to say? Um, wait a minute. I've got, to get, I've got to get my mouse over here. How are we doing? Oh, my God. Okay, I'm having to scroll all the way fucking back. Oh, where are we? Okay, sorry, I'm going to rush through this as quick as I can. Uh, Mrs. Mighty, thank you for the sub. Break Gamer, thank you for the sub. Spray Nard Kruger, thank you for 316 bits. Getting my cheers out of the way before the game starts. Sharty on mains. I don't know what that means. Um, next in, thank you for the sub. J Pan, thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub. Trans de Transcendence. Um, 245 bits from King of Autumn 96. Now for a proper hello. Been a huge fan of yours since the Damages 3 video. Have no idea why, but thank you so much. You kick ass and continue to make us laugh every time you upload. As one comment, uh, as one comment on one of your videos said, you are a living Monty Python character. Oh my God. So what's the? Who's the guy that writes it then? If I'm the character, who's the writer? Be worse. Um, thank you for the gifted subs, pars one fa 11 five gifted subs, incredibly sweet of you. Claughs, resubscribe, thank you so much. Happy to catch another stream, Ho happy to catch you in the stream. Hope you and the family are well, we are, thank you, hope you're doing well. Speed Draco, thank you for the sub, is that what he was doing in the movies? Uh, Twilight Villain, thank you for gifting two subs. Red Lemon Boy, thank you for the resub. Kalen Lux, thank you for the resub. Randy for the- Rundy, sorry, Rundy for the win, thank you for the gifted one sub. J Pan, thank you for 510 bits. Hi, Caddy. First time catching a stream. Been watching since the Crash History video. Wow, that's a weird place to start, but that's that's good. I'm glad. I hope you and the fam are doing well. We are. Thank you, General Snivy. Thank you for 200 bits. Huge fan of your content for many years. Born and raised in the land of Mary. What's the land of Mary? M A R R Y. Hey Siri, where? What's the land of Mary? I find this on the web. Mary Gios, One Piece wiki. Are you from an anime? I have no idea what that means. Anyway, I'm now living in the mainland since 2013. As in Maine, as in the the, the place in the states. I don't know. I'm going off track. Um, I first saw you when your video on Coronation Street and the secret of the missing hotpot recipe when it was released on YouTube. Been watching you ever, ever since. Thank you. Keep doing what you do. Remember to get some rest if you need it. That's why I'm streaming at midnight. Um, that, isn't that obvious? Guys, can you stop supporting me for one fucking second? We're never going to get to... Look, we, we've been going so long now, the game's music has given up. Uh, the game isn't muted. The game's music has stopped because you're doing too much nice. So stop doing the nice, okay? Stop! Oh! I'll put Keras on you if you don't stop. Ugh, Commander CJ1, thank you for the sub. Mr. Warm Milk, thank you for the sub. <laughs> Kaylin Lux, thank you for gifting 10 subs. Insanely kind, thank you. Um, Jazby Plays, thank you for the resub. Nice to see you again. Zach the Pro, 200 bits. Hey, Caddy, been a fan of you since 2018. Now watching you, your Super Martin 64 streams. Got a perfect idea for your future video, the frigid world of snowboarding games. Do you know what snowboarding games, like, you know what you do in them? You get on a bit of wood and you slide down a hill. They're all the fucking same. No. Um, Mrs. Mighty, thank you for the gifted sub. Gets a berry, thank you for $62. Are you serious? Is that a mistake? Shall I refund? Was that supposed to be $6.20? Please let me know. I'm more than happy to refund. Don't know if you're still sick, but here's some money for the cough drop. Oh, thank you so much. No, I'm not, but I'll take the money anyway. Thank you. Um, kiss my axe holes. Thank you for the sub. Council House. Thank you for 200 bits. Hello, Caddy. I'm glad to say I'm feeling better for this stream. Want to open with a joke. Do you really? Two... F <laughs> All right, two fish are in a tank. Suddenly one turns to the other and says, how do we drive this? <laughs> Thanks very much for nothing. Um, Brooksy Plays, thank you for gifting a sub. These days, thank you for subbing. Tomato Wang, I, I, I'm sorry, I cannot fucking wait. That is too far away. Tumatuanga? Tumatuanga? Is that what that says? Thank you for $3. Support you, but really donated to see how you'd attempt to pronounce my name. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry to you, and I'm sorry to your parents for giving you such a lovely name. Tumatuanga, I think that's how you say that. If not, then you're, you have you have the permission to, to come to my house and kill me. 
Rundy for the win. Thank you for the gifted sub. Bizarre Lon, thank you for two month um, resub. Hey, Caddy, the interesting world of Wallace and Gromit games? Nah, probably not. Probably Ardman games. I don't know. I'd have to think about that. Rathman, 200 bits. A surprise to be sure, but a welcome one. Thank you so much. Also, hey, Caddy, Kerrison family. Hope you're having a good night. Yeah, we've had a busy night. That's why we'd started. I just decided, you know what? It's nearly one in the morning. Let's just stream. They're eating beans. They're eating takeout food right now. I'm not because I'm a good boy that's on a diet right now. But um, they're eating... Um, they're eating shit, sloppy food. And that's why Keris isn't on the mic, but she is here, and she's very happy that she's here. Uh, Mystic Morgan, <laughs> thank you for the sub. Platinum Warp Star, thank you for the seven month resub. Hope you're well. Happy Bandicoot. My friends and I had an amazing time watching your latest video in a group Discord call. Really? People do that? It was hilarious fun that night. Thanks for doing what you do. That's incredibly. I, I didn't know people did that. That's really, really cool. That's, that's great. Thank you so much. Anyway, yeah, as you can see. The game hasn't, it's just given up on the music. So um, let's load up joins. Game's loaded. Welcome to the warp room without the music, everybody. It's a bit, it's a bit uncanny. I'm not, I don't like it, but you know, this is just, I don't know how you make it come back. I just want to make, okay, yeah, I can hear it. Oh my God, stop it. Wait, are we playing a game or am I just reading a book? Um. Sand Dragon, thank you for the resub. Matt and Bake, thank you for the sub. And McPeety, thank you for the sub. Very kind of you guys. I've already done all this. What a waste. This is probably my disc being old, to be fair. But hopefully the game isn't going to freeze. We're on World 3 now of Wrinkle of Cowpat. Ho I just hope that the game doesn't freeze. Fingers crossed. I'm going to drink a bit of my point from the local. What? I'm already done what? I was in the second world and I'd it, it already done it. I, because I'd already I went to the wrong world and I'd already done it. That's why I said that. What? I, I don't know how I can explain it. Oh, stop! Ah! Rundy for the win. Gifted a sub. I think I yeah. Thank you. Um, too much to anger. I think that's. I'm hoping that's how the game's fucked, isn't it? The game's broken. It's it's stopped. So the music stopped because it crashed. Fucking fuck. There's no there's no way to play retro games quite like with the original hardware. <laughs> okay, give me a second. I'll be actually are are you go are you standing up? Okay. I, I I'm kind of stuck where I am, so I need you to press the, the green button on the PS2 and reset it. Thank you. Anyway, I suppose I can read the other million bits of support. I, I appreciate you supporting me, supporting me, guys, but we aren't going to be able to play anything at this at this rate if you're just going to throw your money at me. Um, thank you, though. Right, let's see if let's see if this works. Thanks, honey. Right, Matrix. Yes, hacked PS2. Right, PS2's loaded. It's almost like the stream has started again. The disc is fucked. It's not reading the disc. It should have loaded straight away. It's not loading the disc. Oh. Anyway, sorry. I'm gonna read out this bit of support, and um, I'm then I'm gonna have to go on an inter in intermission and try and get the game working again. Um, reading a book, Alison Inc. with 500 pits. Thank you so much. Um, plup plup chunks. Thank you for five dollars. Incredibly kind of you. Guys, stop! I'm just re- I've been going for 20 minutes and I haven't done anything. Please! I can't keep up with this. Guan... Gu Gu Guyan? Guan? I'm not sure. Guyan Bailey at 200 bits. Taking a shot every time you die. My life's in your hands. That is a terrible, terrible thing to put in your hands. Anyway, it's been a while since I've seen the stream. Thank you for five dollars. Um, I'm back and I'm here to plop luff bug all over your chunks. I don't know what that means. Mitty T, thank you for the resub. Spiring, thank you for the sub. I talk, thank you for the resub. That's very kind. Ollie's Poo Poo, thank you for the sub. $6.16 from Miss Twyla. Hey, Twyla, how's it going? So glad to catch another strip. Stop it! I can't handle this! I can't, I've still got to fix the game, guys! Stop! Stop! Oh my god, more. It's gonna have to get to a point where I have to, like, I, oh, jeez, stop! It has to get to a point, it has to... Oh! What? What? 
Ha! I didn't do anything. Guys, I, I haven't touched anything. I haven't left. I haven't touched the console. What? Yeah, loading. Big old fucking steaming load, that is. What what was that? I I'm I'm not even gonna bother. Claire Universe, thank you for resubbing for two months. Big fan of yours. Trying to get motivated to write um Oh sorry, Miss Tw Twilight, I'm getting so completely lost. Should we just get him out of the room? Is he annoying you? Well, on the stairs or something. Um, anyway, Twyla, thank you for the $6.16. So glad to catch another stream. Been dealing with a lot recently. Your streams have always brightened my day. Wondering since it was your in your recent vid briefly, what do you... Quick, quick, guys, stop it. This is ridiculous. I can't... I can't, honey. There's too much to read. I can't not thank everybody. I can't. And also, the game's fucked again. I I, I don't know what to... Okay, I'm, I'm going... Sorry, wait. I'll be back. We're back. Oh, right, how many of you were way too nice to me and just throwing your life savings away for the sake of my stupid face? Let's see, how many more? Quite a lot. Anyway, Twyla, where was I? I was wondering, since it was in your recent vid briefly, what is your quick opinion on PS1 Pandemonium? It's my favorite game as a kid. I have tried to play it and it's, I, I think it, it's a bit too stiff for me. And yet we're, we're back on the fucking circle again. Anyway. Claire Universe, thank you for two-month resub. Trying to get motivated to write a video essay on weird card games, feeling nervous about it. Any advice for a nervous trans girl? Absolutely no advice whatsoever. If you're nervous, have have a popper pill. There you go, do drugs. That's good advice. Um, Slowpox, sorry, I've been away. Oh, stop it! Stop, I, okay, I'm gonna have to ignore this at some point. The, when the game starts, I'm gonna have to stop reading these because I, I actually just can't physically keep up. Um, Owl the Edge, thank you for 300 bits. You may not remember me, yes, I remember. First Rift Apart stream, happy Bandicoot, hope you have a great birthday, your family as well. When um, Final Fantasy VII Remake 2 or 16 comes out, you're gonna stream them, probably not 16, maybe Remake 2, I don't know. Um, it, it depends on patrons, to be honest. Anyway, let's see if the game loads this time. $6.50, thank you for the wonderful videos over the years, um, from RVTH, thank you. Black Ninja 3006, ten dollars. Thank you so much. I remember. Ra Sorry. I my have had some Who's that, Chloe? Can you guess? Orange friend, but I'm not quite sure why. Yeah, see, Chloe got it. Hot in here. Is it safe to be wearing that fur? It looks flammable. 
Uh, anyway, where are we? Lady Ironborn, thank you for the sub. Yeetus Elitus, thank you for the sub. Faded Hero, thank you for the sub. Neo Context, thank you for the sub. Joker Fan, that's weird. Thank you for the sub. Hope you and your family are doing much better. Maybe for your next video you can do a Nicktoons crossover games, maybe. Cra I'm gonna have to up the limits. I'm sorry, guys. This it, this is incredible of you, and it's it's very kind of you. But we're 25 minutes in, and we've done nothing. I can't just spend the whole stream doing this. I really appreciate it, but I'm gonna have to up the limits at some point, because otherwise, I'm just it's never gonna happen. Ah, uh, I, I don't know. What do you guys think? I I don't know. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna just leave that up to the chat and see what they think about that, because. I would, if I could, I would, I would say thanks to every single person on on God's earth. But I don't, I don't have it in me. I'm, this is a stream of a game, and I, I just can't do it. Uh. Anyway, where are we? Sorry, I need to, I need to get through a few more of these. Funeral slug. No, sorry, crazy Jason. Thank you. I wanted to say one of your favorite content creators on YouTube. Love the work you do. Hope you and your family are doing alright. Thank you for the resub. Sub from Funeral Slug. Thank you. 1500 bits. Thank you so much from Lady Ironborn. First stream I've caught in a million years. Here's some bitties. Thank you. Steven, $1. Thank you so much. Saw that you were streaming. I'm currently taking a break from the internet, but I wanted to tip you before I go back into the void. See you in Discord in about a week. Thank you. Don't, you don't have to come back to the internet for my sake. I am not worth the, the cesspool of the internet. Promise me that. I promise you that. Sorry, I'm getting lost. And Woon, thank you for the resub. King of Autumn, thank you for the gifted gifted sub. Thank you. Oh. God, I'm going to need to take a... I'm, you know what, guys, after all that reading, I'm taking a break. Bye. I'm kidding, by the way. I'm, I'm not, no. It's just very funny to me that we've got half an hour into the stream and I haven't done anything yet. <laughs> We're on, we're on, we're a few, a few seconds into the first level of World 3. So, that's fun. Anyway, we're on Gauntlet now. Um, and it is a, rather a bit of a Gauntlet. Um, because you go in, it's medieval, which is where Gauntlets come from. And it's long, like a Gauntlet. And there's lots of things to avoid. Like a gauntlet. Uh, excuse me. And there's a TNT, which were not traditionally in gauntlets, but they're in this game because you can do anything in a video game. You can put explosives in medieval England because they did that, actually. No, they did that when they tried to kill the, 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 the Houses of Parliament. That was the Stuarts. Oh, I thought that was the medieval times. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, whoopsie daisy. Are you jumping back on, honey, or are you just... Okay, all right. Ah, anyway, where are we? The gauntlet, yes. Thank you, Dr. Harris, for the resub. Happy 11 months and happy Bandicoot month. How are you feeling? Feeling better? Yes, I am, thank you. Continuing to play Cash ban Banuka, the Wrath of Cow Patch. Everybody is so close to getting it right. I am pretty sure it's Wrinkle of Cowpat, but again, I could be completely wrong. Oh, yes, I, I forgot to mention. So since the last stream, we have got the double jump. We've got the double double. There we go. We've got the double jubble. And um, it's going to make the platforming a lot, a lot easier. Um, that's really all there is to say about that. Better than the sneaking shoes. I think everybody can agree on that front. Is the dog being sick? Oh my goodness. It's just gonna be one of those nights, isn't it? It is Wrinkle of Cowpat, thank you. Yeah, Stan's fine. He makes noises like that all the time. And then the problem is if if you had to if you had to then get up and drop everything you were doing to tend to Stan for every weird noise he does, uh you'd probably be fifty pounds lighter in a week because you'd be moving so much. You probably lose your legs. You have to kind of pick and choose which weird noises you're gonna look at with Stan because he does weird noises all the time. Well, I don't know what he's doing. Is he being sick? Uh, oh, okay. All right. Ooh. Anyway, where are we? Lightkeeper, thank you for the three-month resub. Hi, everyone. It's good to be back. Well, it's, good. it's good to see you again. We're playing 
um, Cash Banuka 4, the original one, before Crash Bandicoot 4 came out. Because that makes sense. Ah. I do find that a bit cheeky, to be perfectly honest. Like, the whole idea of it, like, um, like, oh yeah, it's Crash Bandicoot 4 is a sequel to only the good ones. Like, whether they whether they like it or not, this exists, and it was Crash 4 in Japan. What's Crash 4 called in Japan, then? But then, but this is Crash 4 in Japan. Crash 40. There you go. It's middle-aged Crash. Crush 40, yeah! Live and learn! Hanging on my bandicoot's morning! What, honey? You did a big fart. Oh. No, I didn't. Maybe the chat did. I'm not even sure if this is, it's possible to get the gem on this level, but, you know, breaking boxes is fun, so let's just do that anyway and see how far we can get. If I remember correctly, this is a pretty tricky level to speedrun for the, the relics, but, you know, like with anything, I know I've done it before, so um, I'll, I can do it again, I'm sure. Okay. Oh, is he? Yeah, no surprise there. Stan's pissing off everybody tonight, clearly. I like it when I start my streams off of half an hour of reading thank yous because, like, it's just, it's, there's too many nice people to talk to. So I spend half an hour reading it and then I spend the next half an hour telling the dog off for being a prick. Oh my god. This is fucking awkward. Okay, I don't think I'm able to. No, I'm not able to do that. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Can I get the gem, though? Or is that for a secret gem? Or... I'm not sure, actually. I'm going to jump up there because that spell is going to definitely hit me. I jumped over that. But you, you do you, do you game. That's fine with me. Actually, I lie. It's not fine with me. It's, it's really it's not fine at all. It's actually quite the opposite. Oh, no. Okay, here we go again. I told you this was a gauntlet, didn't I? Yes, Caddy, you did. Thank you, audience. The whole level's a gauntlet. Oh, fucking me! Fucking me! I'm so shit! Thank you, Mapfew. Um, or Matthew, just with two, P two Ps. Thank you for the resub. What are you talking about, Chloe? A gauntlet is a trial. It's like a... No, it's not a goblet. Th this is a gauntlet. You're asking, is there a gauntlet in the gauntlet? That's like watching Gladiator and going, oh, is there any gladiators in it? Remind... That was a proper nanny moment, you know that. That was a, that was a proper my mum moment. Oh, hey mum, do you want to watch Cat Pirates of the Caribbean tonight? Oh, is that the one with the pirates in it? It's the pink, pink, old... Yeah, it's a jolly coffin, actually. The Joffin. Jolly pink coffin. The Joffin. Joffin Lannister. Wait, is he a Lannister? Yeah, he is, yeah. Is he? No, he's a Baratheon, isn't he? Yeah, but in, but in, yeah, but he's, but everyone thinks he's a Baratheon. Yeah. Ah! Okay, that, you can't, you can't suspend that double jump for too long. Good, good to know for the future. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. It's okay. Oh, the fuck happened there? Oh, there's a nitro. Whoopsie. Okay. Oh, yeah. What's small and helps you get up the stairs? Tyrion Bannister. Oh, I did get the gem. Look at that. Gauntlet complete and only, what, two or three deaths? Not a bit. Not not too bad, if I do say so myselfing. 
So, here's the thing, guys. As you saw from the beginning parts of the stream, disc is a little bit scuffed, a little bit buggered. So, there's a chance the whole game will destroy itself and crash and freeze and everything. But earlier, it's because the PS2 just wasn't reading the disc entirely. And the only way you can get the PS my PS2 to read discs when it stops reading them is to put a big weight on the disc tray. So, we put a cappuccino mug on top of the PS2 to get it working. Um... I think I'm actually going to play it extra safe and save after every level. I know that's going to take up way more time, but it's either that or we start the whole game again. Ah, uh, where are we? Banuka Brandt, thank you so much for 200 bits. Thank you so much. Um, first time I caught you on stream, I'm a fellow Banuka. Oh, are you? Sorry. Um, yeah, you're a fellow Banuka. Are you wild or are you domesticated? I've been a fan of your content for several years. Never failed to make my friends smile. I also decided to follow in your footsteps and going for every platinum relic. Good luck. Went as far as a 200% crash bash and get crash fours purple relics. I haven't even done that. Um, all I have left is nitro car. Wish me luck on all this game's relic. If you've done... I went as far as to get... Yeah, so you've done the purple relics. If you've done that, then... Then yeah, you've if you've done that, you're 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 fine. You're fine. Did I do the purple relics, or was I just doing the platinums and I kind of out of out of protest I didn't do the purples because I just couldn't physically do it. No, I don't think I did. Mek Sama, two hundred bits. Thank you so much. Dali shenanigans was fun. Oh, I'm still doing it. Mine are mostly focused on cats. I made a cat cat version of Cash Banuka. Um, I sniffed the farty. Thank you for the thirteen month resub. I fucking span you, man. Dude. But okay. Um, long time no see. First Crash game I ever played. And um, what me and my sister used to play in the day out as kids. So I hope you're being nice to it. I mean, if it's nice to me, I'm nice to it. And so far it hasn't been too awful. But we haven't got to the really bad bits yet. Glad to see you back. Hope your family are well. You too. Um, Junior Nitro, thank you for the sub. And Braxton, thank you so much. Oh, you can't spin them. You can't spin them. Oh. Okay. Anyway, Braxton, popping in to say happy 18 months. Oh, happy 18 months to you too. Do you want to go for a meal? I think it would be cool if all the PlayStation and PS2 Crash games were on the new PS Plus subscription service. I think, I'd like to think every fucking PS1 game would be there, but you know, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to watch the rest of the stream on YouTube later. Have a great night. Thank you. And hello, future you on YouTube. I didn't know you couldn't kill these guys. I swear you could, but... Obviously you can't, because they killed me. And that's how... That's how learning works. If I'm... Okay, I'm going to try something. Can you spin these guys? No, you can't. Okay, I because I was convinced you could spin one of them, and I was going to say, if you could spin away a fucking moped, and not a little old man carrying things on a little cart, then I don't know what world we're living in. And spin the fish away, most importantly. I'm now starting to think there might be a no-death platform at the end of this place, but I'm not 100% on that. Okay, right. Go for a... Go for that. There we go. Oh, yeah. No, you're absolutely... Oh, hi, hi, Kyle. How's it going? Yeah, you're absolutely right. The, the music slaps in this game. Not every track is great. I don't think it's as consistently great as, like, I don't know, Crash 2, but... As, as a soundtrack, it is really good. As a mother. Wow, that's the first time I've ever used that low kick and it actually be useful. That's incredible. Three, four, five. You think Coco's very cute, honey? Yeah. It was before she became a girl with attitude. She took a page from the book of Sonic. Hey, everybody, I'm Coco and I've got boobs. Oh, she's very Phoebe-ish. Um, Pipka, thank you for four... No, four? No, that's your name. Pipka, thank you for the sub. Right, how do we control this thing? Right, that's jump. Um, how do we go faster? Circle with this one. For some fucking reason. Got another chase here with a... a, a, a as I called it as, as a child, a tsunami. Not even kidding, that is what I... Oh, 
Yeah, Tsumini, I thought this level was called when I was younger. And I'd say to my friends, hey, have you got the relic on Tsumini? I think it breaks the boxes for you. Okay, so the end, of, this is weird. So the end of the level is here, but there's also a checkpoint. Oh, I see. Okay, are there three boxes that I've missed or are they over here somewhere? Thank you for $8.70 next. Incredibly kind of you. Thank you. Sadly, missed the first stream, even though you're playing one of my favorite crash games. Yes, I'm serious. Not that sorry. But I see a death counter. Um, and since I am a being of darkness, here's some money for you to die over and over and over and over. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's probably going to happen. Let's be real. Yeah, are there three boxes here? Oh, I missed them. <sighs> sorry, everybody. I guess I wasn't paying enough attention. I know you come to my streams to expect more. I remember this being a lot harder. Oh, this is the difficult bit. Okay, right. Fucking aced it. No problem there. Where do I go now? Is there supposed to be, like, another... <laughs> I mean... I mean, de death. Death one thing. But also... Oh dear. Oh dear, because I have no fucking clue what happened there. <laughs> and over and over and over and over again, lots of love says next with $5. You know what? Fuck it. I'm starting this level again. I fucked it all up. I missed some boxes and I shouldn't have hit that um, nitro switch. Oh no, one shop. This was not, that was not one of the times you use the tiptoeing because Coco can't do the tiptoeing. It's a totally obsolete power up. It's fucking useless. Ah, uh, yeah. No, I, I, I got that. Yeah, I got that. Thanks, Plush Timothy. That's very kind of you in the chat. Anyway, let's go back to Tsunami. Be prog, my friend. Thank you for 300 bits. Hello from Australia, land of the Banookas. It is, isn't it? Loved your new PS1 accessories vid. I've watched that 100 times over. Thank you. That must have mean you've been watching it for 100 plus hours, uh, which is not not healthy. Random question. Do you think the melody for Hogwarts and Crash 1 sounds like a fiddle? Sounds like fiddle with my ding dong. Yeah, it kind of does, but you could put any words in there. You could put, um, I don't know. Titty and a bum bum, titty and a bum bum. You could put anything there. Happy streaming. Hope you're in the family where we are. Thank you. Shrek on acid. Thank you for the sub. Right, so are the three boxes back here? No, they're not. I'm, I'm just going to need to pay extra attention. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, where are we? Okay. Where could they be? They weren't in the bonus. I'm almost certain I got all of them in the bonus. I'm pretty sure it said like 41 or 42 out of 42. I can't remember, but I'm almost certain I got them all. Let's find out what we fucked up. Yes, it's we, by the way. You're in this with me, guys. Whether you want it or not. Oh, I thought I was going to safely jump on that guy. Right. Maybe it wasn't the bonus I missed them. In Flim, hey, how's it going? Haven't caught streaming forever. Good to be watching. Well, thank you for joining. Yeah, I'm almost... I'm pretty damn certain I got all the boxes here. Could be wrong, though. I guess we'll find out. Or is there, like... Hmm. Wait a second. Two, three, five, one, two, five. Right, so maybe I missed them. 
No, I, I, I don't remember seeing any. No, I don't remember seeing any. I don't remember seeing them. Oh, I see them. I see them. They're in the distance. <sighs> I see them. I see them. I see them with my eyes, because that's what my eyes do. They see, and I saw them with my eyes. Mm. Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah, it's late. It's uh, 20 past one. Oh, you knitted a flag. That's very sweet. Are we going back to Tsunami? Because it's that good of a level? No, it's because I'm not very good at it. That's why. Mm. Oh, Stan's making funny noises again. Oh, he always looks like that. That's his face. He's got an abused animal face. He's a poster boy for abandoned dogs and, like, shelters and stuff. A dog is for life, not just for Christmas. Picture of Stan. Please adopt me. My humans don't feed me more than three times a day. Okay. Let's carry on back to where we were before. Three, four, five, smack. 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 That was what I tried to do the first time. Oh, hang on. Watch this. Watch this invincibility. Oh, I can't really do anything with it here, but... That's it. <laughs> That's probably the biggest mistake they made with this game. So, where are the TNTs? Like, where are they? Oh, they're underneath there. Oh, I see. Oh, they are really sneakily hidden. Ah. Oh, my God. That's, that's mean. That's really mean. This is Crash 4 after all, am I right? Am I right? I said, am I right? Okay. There we go. Got the three. We're good. I got the three. Off we go to the rest of the wet. Ooh, it's a wheel. Let's go along the wheels and follow the trail of apples while the entire town floods. Oh, poor people. Right, I'm pretty sure there was a life crate in the third lane. Yeah, here. Just ignore that fucking sick trick shot I did on the side of the road there. No big deal. I do them all the time. There we go. I know these things probably break all the boxes for you, but it's still kind of fun to do it, so. Right, crystal, checkpoint. Don't break the nitro. Then we jump on this. And then we do all of that again, which now that I'm doing it a second time, I'm probably gonna screw it all up every step of the way. Because I'm very good at doing that. Right. Oop. 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 Oh, God, that was close. Okay, well, there we go. This perspective is shocking. It is shocking, my man. I am blaming the game, yeah. It's a PAL problem. American version's not like this. It's a PAL problem. It's the UK version of the game. It's broken. No, it's just a really awkward perspective. And you're also completely, if you want to, Chloe, you can put your money where your mouth is and give it a go yourself. It's Cash Vanuka! We're being raided by Saf! Hello, Saf! How's it going? And hello, all of you 
364. Yes, 364 Thafians. Thank you so much, everybody. Hello, my name is Jim, also known as Cat. Also known as Caddy, also known as Cad Icarus on YouTube. Uh, I play game on YouTube for fun. But today, I stream game on YouTube for more f oh, I missed it! I missed it! <laughs> I panicked. Thaf made me panic. We're playing... It's Bandicoot month, according to my channel, because Crash is the first... Crash 3, more specifically, is the first game I ever played. I was born in the month of June, and... Crash related news seems to always come out around June time. So I just kind of made I just kind of stapled June onto Crash and made it Bandicoot Month. And because of that, we are continuing my ongoing quest to get through every single chronological Crash Bandicoot game, one after the other, getting every platinum relic. And that's basically it. We have already done Crash 1, 2, not not recently. I did this like last year as well. So we're carrying on from last year. But last year we did Crash 1, 2, 3, Crash Team Racing and Crash Bash. Or did we do Crash 1, 2, and 3 the first year? And then... Yeah, Crash Bash took fucking forever. Okay, I've got that. Can I kill myself and still have the gem? Let's find out. I have to count that as a death, sadly. Saf, I if you consider torturing, yeah, I've got the gems. Sweet. So now I can grab both the gems. Fantastic. If like Wrath of Cortex is janky, I wouldn't call it torture. It's just a little bit funny. It's one of the it's weird. It's it's one of those games where like I get to a certain point, I'm like, ah, oh, this is pretty good, and then the final few parts are just insufferable. It's a proper fuck maybe a six out of ten if I'm feeling really generous, but it's a proper five. Proper five. Strong old 5 out of 10. A good old 50%. A 50 pence piece out of a pound. Honey, do you want your mic back on? Because nobody can hear you. Oh, do you... Back on. Okay. John Marston, thank you for the sub. Yeah, this is where it all starts going wrong. Um, uh, this is where this is where the game starts uh, being really bad. Um, so I am gonna try. Oh. Mm, I have a taste for some deep fried bandicoot. Oh really? So this level is fucking impossible to do if you're trying to get the crystal and the gem in. One go. I'm gonna try. But what's probably gonna happen is that I'm gonna get fed up and give up and just get the crystal first and then come back and get the gem. So you either basically you basically had to do it play the level twice to get everything. Shadow's born, thank you for the resub. But yeah, this is an awful level. This this level sucks. I'm going to try and win and get the gem. I'm not making any promises, though, because it's fucking impossible. It's really... Fu like, this is... Like, it looks as slippery as it is. You know, it's as slippery as it looks. Sorry, is what I meant to say. Okay, I got all the... Yeah, I've got all the boxes so far. I don't know how, but I have. Oh, God, I might actually be able to do it. I might actually... No, okay. Don't worry, I'll try and just win the race. Even though that's fucking impossible. Okay, come on. Get in front. Get in front! Oh, get off! Get off me! Get off me, you old stove! Fucking move! No! Bless you! Oh my god! Get out of the way! Why are you doing this to me? Oh, that was... Okay. Alright. There we go. <laughs> Alright, just fall down the hole. Oh, wait. No, you didn't do that, actually. Yay, I got the crystal. Now i got to go back through the level as slowly as humanly possible to get all the boxes. I got pretty far. 
I got pretty far um, getting all the boxes on my first go there, but you know, you can't have everything. Ah. Oh. Hel um, Hellion. Hellion Kate, I think that says. Thank you so much for three months. Happy Bandicuds, lads. <laughs> Happy Bandicuds to you too and your cuds. <laughs> okay, let's continue. Quaint, yes, as we discovered, yeah. Did you guys know that um, Ke Karis is reading this book called The Curious History of Sex? And um, the word quaint from ye old English actually is an earlier way. Is it, was it an earlier way of saying cunt or is it a... Yeah, just just another word for it. So whenever you read old English text or Shakespeare and they say quaint, they probably mean snatch. They probably mean... There's so many horrible nicknames, isn't there? The worst one is beef curtains. Easily the worst one. <laughs> Easily. Easily the worst one. Because it immediately makes me think of raw meat. And it's just the nastiest shit. Okay, right. Anyway, we've got 34 boxes to hit. Let's hit them. And we got to go... Oh, my God. Slow. Slow down. Okay, right. Yeah, it really is as slippery as it looks. And the only way... And you can't, you can't reverse and you can't go back. So you just got to keep fucking doing it over and over and over and over and over and over again until you get all of the boxes. This sucks. This sucks. This sucks harder than Dyson. And they've got a pretty good fucking suck. They're great on embedded pet hair. Honey. G Tech Fun Engine is really good with embedded pet hair. Yeah. Yeah, because he he got clogged with embedded pet hair. Well, it, yeah, he, he was no, he woke up one day and his throat was covered in embedded pet hair. Where's my G Tech Hoover? And then he tried to suck it out of his throat. And the sad thing is that his Hoover is not actually very good at getting out embedded pet hair. And he died then and then on the bed, grasping onto his only invention in life the G Tech pet hair removal Hoover. <laughs> <sighs> and yes, every single time we quit the level to try this again, we've got to go through those two fucking loading screens. This is going to take forever. I hate this. This is awful. Yes, but I need to get the, all the boxes for the gem. Um, but the problem is that this controls like absolute doggy. So. Oh, and if you fall down. Oh. No, you can't reverse. People complain. People complain about the fucking bike in Crash 3. They clearly haven't played this. They clearly haven't played this. Oh, it's so awful. So awful. Oh, I didn't know. Oh. Apparently, you can fall down a hole and restart the level. I thought that I thought it was like Crash Three. I thought it just brought you back onto the track, but like fifty feet in front of where you were aiming for the boxes. Oh. Well, there you go. I didn't. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. That makes this already a much more pleasant prospect. You lose a life when you fall? Yeah, but don't, do you start from the beginning of the race? I guess we can find out. I've got like 80, 87 lives to kill. 88 lives to kill. So it's really not a big deal. I can just keep trying until I get it right. And then when it comes to the time trial, yeah, it's going to be a pain in the ass because I'm going to have to try and hit all the time crates and beat these guys in a race while they're pushing you around and control the slipperiest fucking jeep that's ever made it onto the shelves of 
showroom. Bleh. But at least you can just restart the level, like, really, really quickly. I'm going to just have to do this as slowly as humanly possible. There's, no, there's not really a, a nice way of doing this. There we go. Oh, my God. It's almost easier to hit them while going fast because you need the speed to get over all the, the ridges and the humps and the bumps and the dumps, but you can't really do that because you basically have to pick speed or control. You can't have both of them, which is really awful. Why is that a bouncing crate? What do you expect me to do? I'm not going to bounce on that and fly to fucking Saturn. What are you talking about? Okay. Come on. Yeah. CEO of Banan. Thank you for the 200 bits. Oh, God. I've got to get over this. Oh, no. Okay. I'm going to try and avoid the... There we go. If you get that speed bump, you basically... You're dead. I'm able to catch your last stream near the end. I'm so glad I was able to catch this one earlier. My 2 a.m. brain can't make up a reason for this donation. I'm sure you'll put it to good use. Thank you so much. Um, good luck on your further endeavors. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Where is the next box coming from? On the left. Okay. Ah. 22. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Just slow, slow, slow. Right, let's kill ourselves then. Where's a hole? Throw me in it. <sighs> yep, and we've got to do it all over again. I genuinely don't actually understand how the people that made this game played this level. And were like, Oh yeah, it's totally possible to get the gem relatively comfortably. Like, it doesn't have to be easy. It just needs to be doable. And it just, it honestly just doesn't feel doable. You just, you just have to keep trying until you just cry. Like, there's really nothing. Basil, thank you for the resub. Very kind of you. I'm starting now to think how the hell did I get the Platinum Relic on this level. But I did. I've got the save file. Johnny Cad. Johnny Cad managed to do it. Why can't Cad just do the normal gem now? Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, there we go. Right. Thing is, the more you, the more you keep tapping on the the accelerator to go to go gently, the more difficult it is to actually go in a straight line. As I just showed you. I hate this. It's so awful. I will not have anybody complain about the fucking goddamn bike levels and crash three ever again. They work. They work. Hello, I'm Ian. Thank you for the sub. I did try doing it really fast last time, Chloe. That's the problem. It's just so fucking slippery. Uh, maybe I should just be going a little bit quicker, but... It's just... It's just no... It's just no support. There's no grip. There's no nothing. Okay, come on, come on, come on, just grab them, yep, yeah, okay, yep, yeah. okay, just grab these ones, yep, yeah. I think I'm gonna have to like line myself up and then just fucking hit the gas and then hope that I crash, you never thought that you'd be trying actively to crash, but trust me, you're gonna need to, okay, right, get over this hole, ideally without hitting the speed pad, Okay, great. Good, good, good. Okay, right. Oh my god! Oh my god! Just stop it! Where is it? Where is it? It's there. Okay, right. Get it, get it, get it. Okay, now we need to grab little tiny, tiny little box here. There we go. Can we get this one? I think this is where we fucked up last time. Yep, new record, lads. New record. We are, we're getting there. We are ahead. Yes. Oh, you heading up, honey. Okay. All right. 
Yeah, no worries, honey. It's okay, don't worry, honey. Have a nice have a nice sleep. I'll be up there in a sec. Well, in a bit. Okay. We're doing all right. We're doing okay. <gasps> no, no, no. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, three more boxes. It's just three. Just cheeky little three. A thumb, an index, and a middle. Come on. Thumb. Index. Middle finger. Thank the Lord for that one. You know what? That good. No, I'm not, that doesn't call for a DJ. It wasn't. It wasn't that impressive. It was actually quite boring. That's the problem. It's slow. It's slow. It's slow. Joe Crow driving his big old blow. Save. Thank you, Fly Guy. <laughs> That's a good. I. That's a good. Fly Guy. Fly Guy. You're the kind of person I want on my new team. Um, the aim with this stream was to actually get um, to the end of Let World 4, so <laughs> we'll see how that, that plan goes. We'll try and get two worlds per stream. Come on, joins. Well done. There we go. Exit. Woo! Nice and safe. Oh, by the way, I completely forgot to mention. Remember in the last stream, I like for some reason, my controller completely fucking broke and it snapped. Yeah, I managed to fix it. Um... I mean, I'll just zoom it in. Yeah, I managed. To, I managed to fix it. It's not as stable. Like if you, if like, it's a bit seesawy, I suppose. Like if you push in the wrong area, it can stick out. Whereas with this one, it's pretty sturdy. Whereas this one is a little bit more flappy. But the button works. It just needed a little bit of super gluing on the hinges where it, where the spring pops it out. Um, because the spring pops out the plastic. And then you need to super glue the hinges back on to stop it from coming out completely. So that's that's all it needed. So yeah, it was all right. Where are we now? Eskimo roll. This is okay, I think. Next, thank you for eight dollar seventy. So kind of you. Thank you, Smokey and the Bandicoot, also known as thirty four crates that feel like two hundred. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I told you I'd be able to fix it. This is one of my. I, I love. I don't know why I love this controller so much. It's just. It's just so, there's something about because it's not glossy and it's not matte. It's kind of in the middle. It's kind of like a car paint controller. But yeah, the silver looks really sweet, and it's got like the DualShock 2 is blue, which looks really good on the silver. It's just very 2000y, very spacey. I like it. And if you don't like it, you can shove off. Right. Now, if I remember correctly from my video I did talking about all the platinum relics. Getting getting the Platinum Relic in this level is a fucking nightmare because you can't see far enough ahead into the level to know where the time crates are and where the holes are. Um, so it's going to be a lot of trial and error when we finally get there. But as a, just a standard level to begin with, it's, um, it's actually all right. It's just another ball rolling level. Oh no, it's Tiny Tiger. Ultimate boss fight from Crash 2 and 3. Whatever will he do? He'll do that. <laughs> He'll get in the way slightly. Even though he didn't. <laughs> uh, thank you for 200 bits. Uh, Banuka Brandt, I think that says. Wait, I'll, I'll read your thing in a second. Oh my god, this is pretty tight. Okay, there we go. Checkpoint. I'll read your thing when I get to this checkpoint. There we go. Oof. Um, I'm not sure if it works on this version of the game. There's ways to cheese certain relic runs. When you grab the clock, Aku Aku doesn't disappear. Yes, I know. I've used that trick a few times. Yes, um, he also stays with you if you hit restart from the pause menu. So Droid Void, yeah, the first section Droid Void having an uh, invincible Aku Aku is pretty useful. But at the same time, you're also isn't Droid Void the one where it starts with the um, monkey swinging section? So maybe it's actually not that use useful at all. Uh, okay, and Dara Hines, thank you so much for three dollars. Greetings from a long-time Irish fan. Love Ireland. How's it going? Here's a funny fact: in your Crash Wrath of Cortex review, if you turn on the captions when Crunch says "puny orange neck," it says "puny four-inch dick." Are you kidding me? No way. I want screenshot proof of this. No way. No way does YouTube think that Crunch Bandicoot says. Finally, I get to wrap my arms around your puny four-inch dick. No way in hell. 
Never fails to cheer me up. Your content never fails to cheer me up. Thanks again. Well, thank you for telling me that, if that's true. That needs to be seen. Oh, no. I've missed a box. No. Can I get it? Can I go back and get it? Ooh. Bit of a frame shit there. Did I miss a box? How far back? Oh! Thank you, guys. Thank you. Um, Chillwalkie, thank you for the sub. Very kind of you. Okay. Thank you, chat. Yeah, it's kind of annoying how, like, the chat is really, like... I know that everyone goes into all caps because it's like I'm not listening. It's got nothing to do with... It's got nothing to do with that. Oh my god almighty, you can't let go of the controller. Okay, another one. Another one bites the dust. There we go. I'll just wait a second. Yeah, the chat is really delayed for me. So when, by the time I notice what people are saying, they're already in all caps when they probably have been saying it for the last like five minutes. Uh, okay. Yeah, there we go. Right, one up here, one over here, and one over there. There we go. Nicely done. Okay, over we go. And through there. What's there? Spin you out the way. Well, you know, nodge you out the way, but it sounds more exciting to say spin, especially when you're in a big globe. I like a spinning globe, like the one we live on. Or is it a disc? What to think about? Okay, got it. Yeah, they want you to, in the relic run, they want you to run through this. Like, they just want you to hold the analog stick in one direction and ho fucking hope to God that you don't die. All you've got is, is an analog stick and faith. That's all you've got. Oh, look, it's the ultimate boss level of Crash 3 that everyone's favorite, Dingodile. I wonder what he's going to do in this game. He's going to have a little bit of lava piss all in the same spot, and he's not even going to aim at you, even though... At the beginning of the game, Uka Uka was complaining, and, and Cortex was complaining, that all the bad guys weren't doing enough to try to stop Crash. And this isn't really... that You're not putting yourself in Uka Uka's good books. You're not really proving to him that you're doing a good job. I'm right here. Turn around, dinghy. Turn around. Oh... Probably all that toast you've been eating. Red is very calorific, as I've learned. Oh my god! I was nearly off there. I was nearly off. Thank you, Tomato Anger. Uh, Tomato Anger. Yeah, I can't remember. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you for the one dollar. Oh, you've put a link. Image proof of the fo the tiny four inch dick. Oh my god! I'm gonna have to look at that later. That is incredible. Thank you so much. That's made my night. Unless you've, like, linked me to Goatsy, in which case, you know, fucking shame on me. For, for me once, shame on me. Alright. Off we go. Down the little, down the little tunnel. Oh, there, he's back. Okay, everybody, don't worry. Tiny was a little bit embarrassed by his last attempts to, to crush the bandicoot. So now he's going to try again. Oh, he tried, bless him. Look, oh, he's, look, he's, he's trying so hard that he's not even turning around and coming after us. They probably knocked them off the payroll. That's probably why they're not bothering. They're probably not being paid by Cortex, and that's why they're getting really upset. Yeah. Another couple of lava jizzes over there. That's nice. In the same three spots. I mean, he's got a good aim. You've got to give him that much. Is that you, Stan? Oh. That was like a, that was like a, that was a stomach growling belch. Look at that. Twyla, thank you for $3.69. Incredibly kind. Heading off now. We'll catch the rest on YouTube. Well, hello, future you on YouTube. Although you said you're heading off now, so that means you're probably still here. Oh, ignore me. Best of luck with the rest of the stream. Um, good vibes. Keep going. Get my, the game malfunctions away. Um, wishing you and the fam a lovely evening and nice sleep. Oh, dear. This is what happens when you're nice to me. This is what happens. Make a fool of me live on camera. Everybody needs everybody needs to know that I'm a very good video gaming man. 
And that doesn't help me when people do that. When they distract me, people then go, Oh no, that Cad Icarus fellow, he's not good at video game. And that makes me very upset because that's all I care about in life is being good at video game and you knowing that I'm a true gamer. That's all I care about. I can't possibly live with myself if you don't think I'm good at Wrath of Cortex. I just can't, I can't handle it. Oh my god. I also missed a box on that, that, um, that platformy bit anyway, so it's probably for the best that we started again anyway. There we go. Alright, there we go. Right, is it over here or is it... Oh, okay, no, we got to get onto that tiny little bit over there. Alright, got it. God, oh my god, I hate this! Okay. There we go. There we go. I'm pretty sure in the time trial, that box is like a, um... Um, I think it's like a three-second crate, and it and it tempts you to go over there, because it's like, Oh, it's a three-second crate! you got to try and hit all of them, but then you're spending way more time reaching the three-second crate than you are actually saving three seconds, so... Yeah, it ain't worth it. <gasps> oh, yes! Oh, we get the foofing funnels. Yes, my favorite bit. Woo -hoo -hoo! I love the foofing funnels. They go foof. Hey, Tropy. I bumped him on the head and he did fucking nothing. Okay, you're probably worse than Dingadal. At least Dingadal has a couple of, like, erratic spits. He just kind of... No, he just has the one. Hello, everybody. I'm Entropy, Master of Time. And how am I going to beat you? Standing in one place and putting putting a little bit of blue on you from one place. Nah. That's, that's all he does. Doesn't use anything else to stop Crash. Nothing at all. all these nitro crates and these holes and, like, which of the boxes do we need and fucking blah, blah, blah. Uh, okay, hopefully, hopefully I got it. Hopefully I got everything. Where's the, where's the, where is the, where is the, what? Where is it? Oh, it was that one. Sorry. Yay, I got all of them. Fantastic. Oh, that is a nasty trick for the last part of the level. Woof. We did it, everybody. Good. We got there in the end. Ah. Oh. oh, Blade Blur, thank you so much for telling me how good I am at Crash games. That's all I need. I just needed a little bit of, um, I needed a bit of appreciation for it. Next, thank you so much for $5.87. Monthly paycheck for Cortex Henchmen. They will share between that amount. Well, you've just tipped them and they're not going to do any, you're not going to give, give you better service. You're not going to get like a bit of, you're not going to get like a little flash of cleavage or something because you tipped them $5. It's not going to happen. Dingadile is keeping it firmly in his pants. Right. Now we're on Fahrenheit Frenzy. Fahrenheit Frenzy. Is that German? Fahrenheit looks pretty German. Would I do a Dreamcast stream? No. I've got no history with... Oh, here he is. your sunscreen. Cause you're gonna burn! Wow! Oh, sick burn in it, lads! I am drinking Pepsi. Yes, Pepsi Max, actually. Zero, zero calories. It's my life force. It keeps me going in the dark times of... Wrath of Cortex's loading screen. It's the time we don't talk about. Ah, uh, ah, oh, Jen's username. Thank. Welcome to the stream. You're drinking regular Pepsi like a decent person. No, you're drinking regular Pepsi like a fat person. That's what you're doing. Right. Now, this is kind of similar to the jetpack in um. Crash 2. Like it, I think it controls exactly the same, if I'm right in thinking. So yeah, once you get once you get going with it, it's not too bad. Uh, 
Uh, another good song here as well. Whoa! That was close. That is a rather poxy spin, though. I will say that much. There we go. That's not really a spin is it, as much as it is a... I forgot my phone and then quickly realizing you have it in your pocket and then going back, you know? Uh, under we go. Let's go. Oh, thank you for the gifted sub, Blade Blur. Very kind of you. Very kind of you. I think going through this bit for the relic is actually kind of fun. This, I think actually this is a little bit easier to control than the jetpack, to be honest. But that could be an unpopular opinion. There we go. Now we're in the rest of the factory level state. Oh, 147 boxes. That's a lot of boxes. There we go. More useless workers. At least they're a little bit more threatening than the other ones. Kind of hidden box there, but not too bad. Oh, and another gifted sub. Thank you, Blade Blur. That's really kind of you. Ooh, that was close. Jeez. I don't think Nitro Crates blow up these ones. No, okay. That's the first belly flop I've done in the whole playthrough. The end level 15 was the first time I've needed to do a belly flop. Kind of speaks for the quality of Wrath of Cortex, doesn't it? Okay, right. Activated a lot of nitro crates, but that's fine because we're going to fucking demolish... Th oh! Brown box hidden in the brown level in the brown town. Okay. Ah. Oh, what was that? Is there a box there or did I just... I'm just seeing things, aren't I? Yeah, I'm seeing things. Oh, no, I'm not seeing things. There we go. The invisible crate. How fancy is this? Didn't last very long, but yeah, it makes you invisible so you can run past all those things that burn you. Have some Monty. Thank you so much, Sir Ozzy Man. Very kind of you. Thank you for $7.06. Incredibly sweet. Thank you. Okay. Oh, Kiba Kitsune, thank you for the gifted five subs. Really, really kind of you. Thank you. Oh, was that a hole? Oh, no, it wasn't. Oh, jeez, I don't know what that was. Right. There we go. Got it. Gotcha. Oh, look, we've got another... I don't trust this game's... I don't trust this game's jank. I just feel like it's gonna dis it's gonna break every single time. Okay, that was fine. That was fine. It's just so. Explain how the fucking Christ I touched a nitro crate. Diagonally in between two crates that were shielding the fucking nitro crate. I didn't touch it. I didn't. I don't care what anybody says. I don't care what you mean, mum. I didn't touch that nitro crate. Didn't touch it. You saw that? Didn't touch it. You think I touched it? Didn't touch it. My toe is big. I mean, yeah, it is. I'll give Crash that. He has got rather fucking gigantic feet. Uh, oh my god. That was a surprise. That's the noise I make when I'm surprised. Okay. Ah, oh, look at that. Crash has a Skellington. Crash has a Skellington. He looks like Pinocchio, weirdly enough. Aku Aku, when can I live to be on my own? Oh, I was going to say, I didn't know if that was a metal crate or not. Yeah, 
Actually, I heard they were doing a live action Pinocchio. Yeah, I don't know why. Isn't Tom Hanks Geppetto? <laughs> Say, everybody, we've got this great idea of a Pinocchio live action remake. Now we need to cast the proper Italian old man. Who've we got that we can use? Ah, yes! Tom Hanks, everyone's favorite old Italian man. Who's voicing Pinocchio? Jack Black. Robert Downey Jr. is voicing Pinocchio. Oh my god. Sir Ozzy Man donated 1410. Thank you so much. Help Caddy, I'm cold. Oh yeah, it's winter for you guys, isn't it? If you're in o if you're in Oz. I didn't think about that. Um, help. Okay. Um think hot thoughts. Look at the look at the screen. Um, take your TV. I'll get. If you go right to the fire, look. I'll put it right on the screen. Look, it's right there. Take your screen and put it where your fireplace is. If you haven't got a fireplace, buy one. Put it there, and then look at the screen, and you'll feel warmer by looking at the fire. Okay. Yes, I got it. Excuse! Oh, it's the Pepsi. I'm so sorry. I shouldn't be doing that. It's really, really rude and disgusting. And you expect more from me. I'm very. Yeah. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a role model. Uh, Hewlett fan. Thank you for 14 month resub. Glad to hear from you again. Wanted to commend you on the incredible long videos you decided to do since the beginning of this wretched decade. Thank you. Never go back since your channel has never been better. Yeah, I, do you know what? I completely agree with you. Thank you. Thank you for validating what I thought about my own self. Um, also, did you have a good jubilee? Yes, because I didn't fucking celebrate it. Villa, thank you for $20. Incredibly kind of you. Was that a mistake? Do you want me to refund you? Was that supposed to be $2? Please let me know. Um, fourth time catching COVID. Ouch. Still having enough energy to catch your streams. Gathering all the infin infinity COVID stones. Oh, God. So if you snap your fingers, are you just going to give everyone COVID like at once? I don't want that. Shrekin in, thank you for ten dollars. Was that supposed to be one dollar? Please let me know, I'll happily refund it. Here is for every year I've been subbed to the YouTube channel. Ten years! My god, man. Thank you so much. We're now on boss three. Mm. Ah, the triumphant hero crash. Reduced to a pile of smoldering ash. Oh, oh, okay. Let's finish this. Oh, is that all you got to say? <laughs> Thank you for cranking my style, Crunch. I had him going there, and then you really fucked it. Ow, that really hurts. Let's finish this. Leave my levels alone! Let's finish this. Lots of this game's lines from the bad guys are just like one sentence, if if not like five words at most. Yeah, this is kind of like a boss fight. It's kind of like a boss fight. I remember as a kid, this one used to give me a lot of trouble. The hitboxes on some of these stones can be really fucking picky. Oh, I'm not even close. Oh, I was supposed to get... I didn't realize... I didn't realize that using the hose makes you go slower. Sorry. Yeah, so the idea with this is that he's running towards you, and it's kind of like a boulder chase scene, but, you know, it's not because there's no boulder, unless you want to call him a boulder, which I, I, I'd understand. He does look a bit like a boulder. But then you got to chase back after him and then get him wet. And then he steams off... <laughs> And then he kneels down after the steam, which we all do. And then he chases you a little bit further with every phase. And then he, th he throws more rocks and then they start breaking at some point. It's just, yeah, sometimes you can be in the wrong place at the wrong time to get around these fucking rocks. The final phase is really fucking tense because of that shit. Because that's when they start, yeah, they start breaking into smaller rocks and stuff. Oh, and that. 
I forgot about them. But you can jump over them, so it's fine. Can't put them out, though. Don't worry, you can you can put you can extinguish the big fiery boulder man. You can't extinguish the tiny little on fire stone though. Okay, oh this is this is where I fucking fail. Oh my god, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. Thank you so much for the support, everybody, but I'm not ready to support myself. No. Okay, okay. Oh my god, I hate where I just don't know where he's gonna fucking throw. Okay, okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay, now we gotta get to the end without him shitting on us. Yay, we did it. I was expecting to die at least once, but we didn't. Woo! That was really good timing on the donation there. Is Are you sure about that? $75 Slayer. Dude, you came in a couple of days ago and like gave away your fucking pension. Stop it. Are you sure about that? Are you sure you don't mean to refund that? Are you sure? Was that not supposed to be 75? That's insane. Dude, thank you. Thank you so much. Is that why they call you Slayer? Because you slay, girl. Thank you so much. Sir Ozzy Man as well. Thank you for the resub. $5 from Space Noodle. Thank you so much. Lots of love. Lots of love for Wrath of Cortex, which I was not expecting. Love your videos. You're very funny and entertaining. I love the chaos. Thank you so much, Space Noodle Dragon. Very kind. Yeah, Slayer, come on, jump up in chat. That's that, yeah. It's nice to say, yeah, I, I see what you're saying. Accept our generosity. I get what you're saying, but in my position, it's kind of strange because I'm not, that, that's a lot of, that's a lot of money. And I don't expect anybody to do that. So, I'm just double checking because I would never, ever expect to get that, let alone accept it. So, I just want, I want Slayer to tell me that it's all okay. Right, so now we've got the Death Tornado Spin. Oh, no, we're going to get yelled at. Vortex! Vortex! Oh, that mindless masupio is still collecting those crystals. He's defeated Rocco and Wawa. I'm beginning to question... How could he have defeated somebody called Wawa? The strongest mask in the world. I don't need another mask's help. I could take this crash punk out with my metal arm tied behind my... Oh, Crunch. Stop being silly. Uka... He will use was someone the jerking him off? No need for you to why did use he, any beauty sleep. Why did he make that? What was that noise? Oh, <laughs> uh, well. Well. Cortex! Well done, joined. You're 36% done. We have already done better than Rakuzi. I oh, know she got 16 crystals, but I got 80. I got 10 more gems than her. She sucks at these games. Anyway, exit. We're going to try and get World 4 done. But now we've got the Death Tornado Spin. Yeah, look at that. How nice is that? Now, I remember in um, $1.23 from 456789. Thank you so much. Incredibly kind of you. That's way too kind of you. But I remember when some call me Johnny did a video about this game. He mentioned how, like, the, the shadow, the drop shadow would disappear when he did the Death Tornado Spin glide. Maybe it's glitching, like playing the Xbox version on the Xbox 360. I'm not sure, but... Or maybe it's a level-specific thing, but right now I, I have it. Um, it's annoying. I think for as, as crazy as the load times are, I think the PS2 version and the GameCube version are probably the better versions. And the GameCube would load faster. I would have liked to have think. Oh my god, who are you? I've heard so much about you, and this is the hero I have to blow away? Ha! Seems like a bunch of hot air to me. Now, here's some trivia for you. That mask is voiced by the current voice of Crash Bandicoot in the games now. Small world, eh? Hey, yeah, people in the chat, you fucking read what I was going to say. Absolutely, yeah. Oh, God, we got a lot of gifted subs there. Thank you, Rabid1. That's really kind of you. That, there's a lot of gifted subs. Thank you. Sometimes, I don't know why... Yeah, I don't know why sometimes the gifted subs come out as individual sub notifications and why sometimes they come up... Yeah, like that. I don't know why sometimes they do that and sometimes they don't. I, I have to look into that. And Gregors, thank you for the sub. Very kind of you. Okay. Um, another great track as well. Another great track. Now, 
This is another one of those instances where it's kind of like Smokey and the Bandicoot. At the very end, there's a snowboarding bit. And fucking hell, hitting the boxes and everything is a pain. It really isn't fun. Probably the only other, other time I'm using the low kick that's actually useful. Colsey, thank you for the sub. Zavi, Savvy Bows, thank you for the sub. Very kind of you. Are there any death platforms in this game? I don't think there are, actually, now that I think about it. Apart from level one. I don't think there's been any other since level one. <laughs> so they, they're just like, well, what's in Crash 3? Death platforms. Okay, well, let's make sure to put them in. But not but not anywhere else. Just level one. Maybe they put it in level one and then realize they just, just you know, like, oh, we've, we've done our bit. We've obliged the Crash 3 beans. <laughs> now we can just carry on. I think I fucked up there. Wait a sec. I think I shouldn't have done that. Nah, it's okay. All right, okay. Ah. Oh. I also get a feeling that I have um, missed some boxes, but I guess we'll see in a second. Yeah, 43, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, no, I've done it. Okay, that's fine. I wasn't sure if um, blowing up all those other TNT prematurely has fucked something up, but it didn't, so it's fine. Oh, hello, Arabo. How are you doing? Oh, the gauntlet has one? Oh, sorry. I'm wrong then. Well, I didn't get to see the gauntlet one, did I? No, I didn't, because I died on that level. Well, uh, well, either the outline of the platform was very well concealed, or I just went ran right past it, or... I don't, I don't fucking know. Right, so... Yeah, this is a bit of a pain, this bit. Um... It's, it's actually not that bad. It looks worse than it is. Because the, ju the jumping isn't isn't dictated by the direct the momentum of where you're sliding. So, it's, yeah, it's not a big deal. Rabbit1, thank you for 500 bits. Fun fact, the current voice of Crash also played Fatso in Casper's Spirited Beginning. Oh, my God. So, you've got fucking Tawley Shaw Pinocchio and James Earl Jones. Oh, my God. What an insane movie. Absolutely insane. I'm going to try... Actually, this is nowhere near as difficult as Smokey and the Bandicoot. And I'm at, again, I think... I think the avalanche itself breaks all the boxes for you. But either way, yeah. I think you get an extra gem for going through all of these, um, these little things here. Pretty sure, anyway. Or I'm wrong? close. That was really, really close. Jesus. Yeah. Perfect. Are you heading up, Chloe? Alright then. See you tomorrow, Chloe. Have a good sleep. Sapphire, thank you for the gifted subs. Really kind of you. Well, aced that in one go. That went Ooh. better than I thought. Yeah, that was nothing like smoking the Bandicoot. That, that control's really tight. I don't know what I was talking about. Ignore me there. Ah. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry. You didn't come to the stream for for Belt JSMR, did you? Ah, oh, I'm sure someone out there likes that. Nice, three gems. That's not three gems. Oh no! Here we go, boys. Who's ready for the fun? <laughs> Ooh, go back and do the gauntlet. No, oh no, what I'll do is once I get all the colored gems, unless the gauntlet is a colored gem one from the death platform. I'll do the gauntlet. Okay, I'll go back and do the gauntlet if... Yeah, at the end, I'll get boss four done and then I'll go and do the gauntlet and then we'll stop the stream. How about that? That sounds good. Because what I want to do... Gauntlet is a colored gem. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, so there you go. Um, I'll do that then. Rabid won 500 bits. Thank you so much. Gets better. Stretch is played by Captain Quark. And Stinky is played by Goofy. No fucking way. Um, Sapphire, thank you for a thousand bits. Hey, Caddy, serious question. Why is it that you don't like it when we send money? <laughs> it's... Oh, my God. It's... 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 
No, it's not a um. Igno no, sorry, I'm trying to think about. No, I am very. I I love it so. It's very very. I appreciate it so much. Do not get me wrong. I I I, I just don't feel like. It's, I don't know, it, it, like, I know how hard it is to make a certain amount of money. I've been there before, um, and now I've got a great job, and, and like, I, I don't know. I, I think what I'm saying is that, like, I've never seen myself as worthy of that much money, let alone someone working their ass off to make that much money and then just give it to me, like... I don't know, and it just, it, it doesn't creep me out or weird me out or anything, it's just, I'm not, I, I, I it just doesn't make sense to me why someone would want to do that, and I, I, it's incredibly appreciated, don't get me wrong, I, I, I'm tripping over my fucking words, but I really can't explain it, I can't explain it, um, but it's not about not liking it, it's just about not understanding and not being able to emotionally convey why people are being so generous to me. I think that's what it is. And then obviously you guys just, you just fucking bombard me one after the other. You, you avalanche me with so much fucking support at the start of streams that I barely get, I barely play any game for the first half an hour of most of the streams. And yes, I, and I jokingly get annoyed by it, but yeah. And yes, I could have answered that question while doing that because, Jesus Christ, this is the monkey swinging in Crash Wrath of Cortex. And I, I'm fucking dead. <laughs> One dollar, thank you so much, Lightkeeper98. Um, uh, where are we? I just felt like giving you a little something to say thanks for the content. Thank you so much. Yeah, don't, don't get me wrong. It's not, it's not because it's not appreciated. It really isn't. It really isn't. Um, it's, it's mostly just, I... I'm not used to people being that nice. I don't think I'll ever get used to pe people being that nice. And it's one thing to have people that like what I do. It's another thing entirely to have people financially go out of their way. Ugh, I hate this fucking method. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry if it comes across as disrespect. I, I'm trying to... It's it's fucking twenty past two in the morning. I don't know I don't know what I'm talking about. Just ignore me. Um, but yeah, no, I, I of course like of course I like it. I massively appreciate it. But it's just it's just yeah. I don't I can't explain it. I really can't explain it. Anyway, where are we? We are your extra Joe. Thank you for two hundred bits. concentrate. Um, that avalanche bit reminds me of how in bears repeating in Crash 4, the hitboxes on the crates with the bear riding were very forgiving. Nothing like what I've seen from you or other people's footage. I was playing the Switch port. They might have they might have updated it. They might have changed it. The, yeah, because, I mean, the video evidence is there. At least the first release, it's fucking unplayable. In Flim, thank you for 250 bits. I thought we were playing Crash, not Sonic Slowdown. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I know that you couldn't keep up, guys. Um, I'll, I'll make sure to go even slower. $7.50 from Shadow Dragon Axe. Thank you so much. I miss most of the stream, which makes me sad, but hey, you're going you're going to make working during the day, um, during summer cleaning at school so much better. Thank you so much. Uh, Run GMC. Thank you for the sub. Oof, I will get on the level, I promise. Great. I hate this fucking level. Like, there's no, there's no two ways about it. This is just a bad level. Um, Lasherus, thank you so much for five dollars. Don't you disrespect me? I'm so sorry if I did. I didn't mean to. What did I? Did I call your family members awful names? Don't you dare disrespect me. Wait, why am I throwing money at you while yelling at you? Shark aside, you equals yay. Your reasons are understandable. <laughs> thank you. And twenty-five dollars from Crash himself. What the fuck? Thank you so much. Are you sure that wasn't a mistake? Um, whoa, celebrating twenty-five deaths. 
One dollar for every death. Jesus Christ, maybe I should die about five million times. That sounds like a good idea, doesn't it? Yes, Caddy, I thought so too. Okay, right, there we go. Okay, I'm actually thinking... Yeah, I was going to say, actually using the monkey. It, you're so slow, it's not even worth it. Uh, Baron of Worms, thank you for the sub. Oh yeah, by the way, that loading, there's... You'll hear it when we get back on the bonus platform, but the loading, the loading sound effect, that now, 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 that it goes on throughout the entirety of these space levels, and you will learn to hate it. Oh, thank you, virus and threat protection. Thanks, Windows security. I didn't know I had that. Cassidy, that's really kind of you. Thank you. Oh, look, guys, shall I use the the sneaking shoes or shall I just do that? This game's fucking weird, man. They wanted to do so many things in their own way, but also wanted to do everything Crash 3 did, and it just none of it matches. <laughs> yeah, let's see if you can hear the down, 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 down. Wait for it. Oh, oh you can't quite hear it. Five dollars from Fiend the Falcon. Thank you so, so much. I remember getting so excited to get this game as a youth. It froze the four times I tried starting it up, and unlike Crash Bash, I have yet to repurchase it. Wow, you repurchased Crash Bash and not this. That says a lot. How do we do the... Oh, it's square. Okay. Why is... What the fuck is going on with these controls? What is going on, man? Why can't I aim up there? My god, this is awkward. Can I jump on these guys? No. Nope. Don't you love it when you're in a giant fucking mech suit with giant fuck-off feet and then you go over to a tiny little, like, beaver alien, jump on his head, and then you get killed? Don't you love that? You know, these, these boots were made for stomping, and that's what they won't do, you know? Like, come on. Um, $7.05. Thank you so much from Sir Aussie Man. Thank you for cheering me up over the past couple of months. Been in a dark place the past 11 weeks. I'm so sorry to hear that. You've always brought a smile to my face. Thank you for the smiles. Oh, no problem at all. I'm glad to be the provider of smiles. So I'll be the smile doctor for you, if that's all right. Yeah, so we can we can stomp on these fucking we can stomp on wooden boxes, but little green fleshy like kittens we can't stomp on. That's going too far. That's too unrealistic. Oh, this this is awful. Do you want to see something weird as well? This is the running jump, right? Okay, that's the running jump. Yeah, this is the stationary jump. Why is there a wind-up? Why is there a wind-up for a single jump and not for a bigger jump? Because I crap my pants. That's why. I'll oh, just aim at it. Thank you. Like, you have, like, a vague direction, a vague idea of where the, the laser is pointing, but you don't actually get an idea of where it, the, the Wampa Fruit's going to go until you actually land a target. Oh, it's just, and there's so much that like, it's dark and you can't see and because it's dark. I want to say this is the level where you need to have all the colored gems to get through it or is that the final level? Oh, I can't remember. Thank you Lightkeeper for 500 bits. Incredibly kind of you. Good night Caddy. I'll watch the rest on YouTube. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. And Dr. Cortex. What? Thank you for $5.87. Finally, my greatest obstacle for the Bandicoot, malfunctioning robot suit. No, I'd say it was, honestly, the greatest obstacle for the Bandicoot is a, is a stationary jump. <laughs> like, you've already wrecked him.
Oh, and I'm pretty sure as well, if you haven't got a target, you don't fire a you don't fire a wumper fruit. I could be wrong about that though. Ugh. Emperor Fluoro, thank you so much for seven dollars five. You guys are being way too nice to me tonight. Thank you. This is the second best crash game. You gotta upset chat by saying things like that. You can't say slurs in my chat. It's in the rules. The best Crash Bandicoot game is Crash Boom Bang. They are the true gates the great. Uh, you know what I'm saying. They're the true greats of the gaming franchise. I mean, okay, Crash Boom Bang, I'll give you that. Sapphire, thank you for 1100 um, bits. Incredibly kind. I wasn't fully sure how you felt about it. That's why I asked. Well, I wasn't. Sorry. Well, I wasn't fully sure how you felt about it, so that's why I asked the question. Oh, I, okay. Oh, yeah, like, again, I mean, it's, yeah, don't get me wrong, it's, I'm, I mean, the whole getting annoyed with reading everything, that's obviously, I'm just performing, like, that's just, I'm being, I'm being dumb, but, like, yeah, as a general thing, it, it's just, it, it surprises me that people would, what, willingly want to do that, and it always catches me off guard, I never know how to properly thank anybody, and I always think, for a split moment, oh, it's a purple gem, yeah, I always think for a split, Split second, like this was this must have been a mistake, you know? Like, there's no way I, I, that I've earned that, you know? <laughs> hey guys, I got a great idea. Let's put Crash Bandicoot in this mech suit from Aliens and give him a bazooka gun. Yeah, that's a great idea, but he can't jump on anything, and he's got a big metal robot arm, but he can't hit anything with it either, so when he's right next to a tiny little turtle robot, he can't fucking kill it. Yeah. Apart from then, I guess that I guess the Wumper Fruit has a, has a wind-up? No, has a blast radius? I'm not really sure. Oh, dear. Okay, gotta get that now. But I can't see where the fuck I'm aiming. And I... What is he doing? Come on, Crash. It is no time for a seizure. Why can't I aim any higher? Oh my god, I hate this. No. This is awful. This is... Yay! We got it, guys. I did it. I'm good at game. That was really fucking close. I was in between a rock and a hard place there. Either an exploding enemy. Hey! Oh my god, that took forever. Oh, the disco room! That's where we were going. Of course we were. Uh Good. Didn't I say in my video that this mech suit is as fragile as a wine glass? If it's... I don't remember which video that would have been. If it was the Crash Wrath of Cortex separate video I did, then I don't remember. I really won't remember. I barely remember what I did in the last video, to be honest. I write it down, record it, and then just kind of move on. <laughs> oh, the gauntlet had the purple gem. Oh. Okay. I see. I understand. Oh, yeah. Another brilliant level. Crash Toroids. Get it? <laughs> Uh, this is a uh, this is a pun level, um, and it's also a space dog fight. Is there a draft in here? <laughs> so your <laughs> your ultimate threatening words of fear that you're trying to shake Crash to his core with was you coming in. And quoting my great nana. That was what that was. You quoted, you you walked, you waltzed in and went, Oh, it's a bit drafty in here, idiot. And then you fucking left. Thanks, Chuck E. Cheese. Thank you. Thank you for the sub, Death Bat Gamer. But yes, this is a, a dogfight in space, this one. Space stations that are ready to strike the planet. Uh, it's just another bog standard fucking space level, you know, Crash Bandicoot guy. And, um, yeah, not really much else to say. Thank you. Thank you so much, game. Very, very kind of you to have enemy fly into my ship from off screen and take off 30 fucking. Another 30% of my health gone immediately. What the hell? Okay. And, okay, I can dodge. I can dodge, but 
it doesn't seem to make any fucking difference. Oh my god. Yeah, this isn't your standard. This isn't your standard, um... This isn't your standard, um, crash space level. It's, mu it's much better, actually. Dare I say, it's the best. Just fucking hit them. Oh my god. Go. Go. Blow up the thing. No. Okay, fine. Try again. No. Okay, fine. Try again. Yay, we did it. Oh, you flew into the back of me. That was fair, wasn't it? How am I supposed to avoid that shit? Hey, I got my health back. There we go. That's that's fine, at least. I got my health back. Why the, f why the fuck do they call it a dogfight anyway? Out of every possible animal you could use to describe planes shooting each other to death out of the sky, why do they call it a dogfight? It's like taking your, your beloved into a tree and um, playing cards with them and calling it a mole fuck. Like, what, do, what does that even mean, dogfight? Dogs don't fly. Do moles even fuck? Do moles? Do moles fuck? God, what would that look like? What about those like star? Sh the, the, what about those like starfish nose moles? Do you think they have like a an, an avatar Navi kind of thing going on where they have to like like link up their starfish noses together and then like every individual leg of the starfish nose wiggles around and then they like seed each other? Can I get it? Oh come on! Please. No. Where am I? Come on. I'm so nearly there. Okay. I was expecting to die at least twice on that level. Because shit kills you off screen all the time. Uh, anyway, where were we? Sapphire, thank you for gifting subs. Incredibly kind of you. Thank you. Really sweet. Really sweet of you. Thank you so much. Yeah, I think, I think going... Sapphire, going back to what you were saying earlier about the whole... Not, not really knowing how to react to people donating and stuff it, it, it kind of it extends as well to the fact that like i have got as far as i'm concerned yeah it's stressful yeah it has its problems yes there's a lot of it's 2 30 2 30 in the morning i'm still working there's a lot of this stuff there's lots of sleepless nights there's loads of working literally until like you'll start work at 12 p.m one day and not finish until 1 p.m the following day there's a lot of that but with all that said I wouldn't want to do anything else in the world. It's the best job in the world. It's far, well, at least what I've been doing because I'm completely, I can just be myself. I can fuck around and, you know, I can ask, can moles fuck on live on stream and people will pay me to ask it, you know, like what, who doesn't want to be in my position, you know? And because of that, and like, yeah, that's what I mean. I, I put myself back to when I was a supermarket cashier and when I was sweeping up in building sites and cleaning up sawdust and shit and i'm like i know how much like 75 dollars is you know i know how much 25 dollars is i know how much five dollars is and how much it takes for people to earn that and it it just it, it's just mind-blowing to me that people would willingly want to part with that for me you know um that's and it just yes and i just, sometimes i just don't know how to respond to it because it's like yeah it's just insane to me it's incre it's yeah, yeah. Oh my god. What the fuck happened there? I don't like any of this. Just I'm just letting everyone know. I'm putting it on the record. I don't like any of this right now. Um the rip 10. Thank you for the sub and Sir Ozzy Man with another donation of $3.53. Thank you so so much. Um do moles wrestle? That's a very good question. Do dogs fight? Yes, they do. So I suppose moles must. If they do wrestle, do they know that they're wrestling? Because they can't see anything. Do they think that they're hugging or that they're wrestling? That's the next question. Oh. Go, 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 go. Oh, I hate this. I can't see where anything is. Okay. Oh, run. Run. Float, I mean. Float. 
God, I fucking hope I got all the boxes. Right, where are we? Yeah, did I get everything? Yep. Okay. <gasps> Oh god, it's the ball bag. Oh no. Fuck off. Oh god. Go, 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 go. Blow it up. Bomb it. Bomb it. I'm like Obama. Okay. Oh, I thought that was part of the background. That's one of the enemies. Jesus Christ. The very idea of that tiny little, like, sea urchin destroying this fucking, like, globe-shaped mecha submarine in one hit is still something I refuse to believe, but you know, that's that's the world we live in. That's the reality we've got to buy into. Ah, get out of the way! Oh my god. Okay. Baby shark you, 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 be. Oh, that was good timing. Thank you, Sir Ozzy Man. Oh my God, you're be you're being way too generous today, dude. Thank you so much for thirty five twenty six. Incredibly kind of you. Last one, I promise. I hope you do, because you won't be able to feed yourself if you're not careful. Hope you have a good stream, Daddy Caddy. Thank you so much. Incredibly kind of you. Oh my God, it's Baby Shark. Do 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 do. Get out of the way. Right. Okay. Right. Where are we? Ah! Right. Ah! How the hell was I supposed to know that was coming? I can see that. It's like on screen. I can plan. Okay, right. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah. We're at the point where we're just rolling over the lives now. They don't, they're meaningless. And when life is meaningless, you know what that means. There's no point. Just give up. Then we lose this fucking thing, thank God, and end up in the better version of the... And yet I blow myself up anyway. God, I'm going to risk this. Oh my god, that was close, but that's fine. I'm a smaller target. I can move quicker. I can spin really quick. I can react to things that are happening right in front of me because the spin is an instant attack against whatever is basically right next to me. Can I spin these things? Yes, I can. Okay. And also, um, for anyone that wasn't aware of this, you can do this. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to do it when I'm safe to do it. Yeah, I'll do it here. Now that you've got Death Tornado Spin, this is something Crash 3 didn't do, and I think it would have benefited, but watch this. Yeah, man! It's actually, believe it or not, it's quicker than spamming X to fast paddle during the Sapphire... No, no, during the Relic runs. And you're also in attack mode, so you'll attack anything that's in front of you, and you move quickly. Um, yeah, it's, it's actually a really fucking good feature. Um, I will give them points for that. So if there's any um, Wrath of Cortex devs watching this stream, um, I give you um, a clap. And that's that's it. Let's carry on. Oh, what's that? Oh! Oh, sneaky. Oh, fuck, I hope I got all the boxes! I hate the... I, ha I, I hate box hunting in. I don't mind these levels necessarily, I just hate box hunting in them. Box hunting really is not fun in these levels because they're, they're just too wide. <laughs> Getting through there is a bitch. Okay, right. There we go. God. Okay. Jesus Mary, that was fast. Who gave you permission to do that? Silver? I can hear the exit. 
There's the crystal. Oh my god. Okay, please tell me I got everything, please. No! No! Il bastardo. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. That's how I feel. I feel like a bastardo. Trust me. Do you know what? I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna. I'm gonna look. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go backwards and hope that I missed it in this part of the of the level. Hopefully it wasn't in the um. Hopefully it wasn't in the submarine bit. But if if it's hanging around somewhere. Around here. And I will give it a fucking good look. I, I doubt it, but it's worth a look. It's better than doing the entire fucking level all over again. And also, we had Lady Ironborn. Thank you so much for $6.90. Incredibly kind. Thank you so much. Right, is there anything over here? No? Okay. Oh, please tell me it was here somewhere. Please. Please. Oh my god, it isn't, is it? Back at the beginning, isn't it? You know, the funny thing is that even if I do find the box, I've got to get to the end of the level with that. Yeah, I fucked it. Nice knowing you, everybody. Finally, the nightmare came to li came to life. The singular Mr. Box donated five dollar eighty cent. Oh dear! <laughs> Thank you. It could have been a changing crate. Oh, I fucking don't know. I don't know. Oh, let's find out. Let's find out. The annoying thing is I did I didn't pay I didn't pay attention to how many boxes I had at the end of the submarine bit, so I'm not gonna know. <laughs> I'm not even gonna know when I get there if I missed one or got one. Oh my god almighty. Yeah, it's probably in the seaweed wrath, you're probably right. You're probably right. Oh, brother. Oh, brooder. Oh, breeder. Okay. Just gonna fire torpedoes like a fucking madman. Look at me, I'm Russia. Gonna fire torpedoes everywhere and hope to God that I hit every... Could it have been one of these boxes? It might have been one of them. Oh, fuck knows. It really could have been anything. I'm pretty sure that all the boxes are low. Because why would they be high? I mean, some of them float, I guess, but... <gasps> Jeez, was it this one? Could have been that one. I think I might have avoided those nitro crates entirely. Thank you for the gifted sub, Sapphire, in way too kind of you. You're also being way too nice to me today. down here. I'm almost certain. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. I can work with that. Yep. We 
get everything in there. We did. Get that one. <gasps> you little fucking clum shit. <sighs> that was really close. Oh my god. Oh, this is too much for me. This is too much for me to handle at this time of night. Oh, there's a changing crate. I got that one. Oh. Okay, right. Uh, nah, nah. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, right. Floating box. Box on the floor, anybody? No. Okay. Floating box. Uh, ah, where are you? Oh, you're there. Okay. Okay, we've got a checkpoint. I think we've got everything. Sapphire, again, thank you. I've had a really good day trying to spread my positivity. Well, thank you so much. Just don't, just don't put yourself in dire straits over it, especially over someone like me. As long as you can promise me that. Like, your finances are a million times over more important than mine. I'm the stupid British guy at three in the morning playing Wrath of Cortex and trying to 100% this fucking Coral Canyon. Like, I'm not someone who deserves anything. So as long as you're not putting yourself out... Times are tough now. They're, they're always tough, but they're getting tougher. Year by year, day by day, week by week. And I just want to make sure that if anybody is going to do anything nice, that it is completely within their power to do it and they don't feel obliged to i think that's the ultimate goal i don't want anybody to feel like they have to because oh they like my stuff so they have to no absolutely not my stuff will always be free on youtube bloody bloody blah i just thought wait a second i just thought was there, please chat, just tell me, was there, at the end of this level, was there a nitro crate switch? Or should I have been blowing up all of these nitro boxes as I've been going along? Because I need to, because if that's where my missing box was, that would explain a lot. There is a switch. Oh, thank God. Okay, unless you're all fucking with me. <laughs> unless you're all, you all want me to get to the end and then... <gasps> I got tickled. I got tickled by the the arm. I got tickled by the octi arm. Oh, I didn't like that. I got tickled by the sucky arm. Oh, oh. Sapphire, thank you. 550 bits, thank you again. No promises will be made. I've been keeping my eye on spending. Well, I hope I hope so. Thank you so much again, Sapphire. Very kind of you. You should definitely rename yourself to Platinum because Sapphire is the worst relic in these games. I don't know why you've given yourself third place on that. Um, uh, uh, I think I have everything. I'm almost certain I have been up and down and all around 43... Does that sound right? Or do we think I've missed one? What do we think, guys? What do we think? <laughs> yeah, I, I did hit the switch and then I missed one box. Yeah, it's just because I'm, I'm tired, that's all. Go for it. Okay. Okie dokie. I'll give it a go. The point of no return, lads. Fuck you! <laughs> after all the... After all the build-up. After all the fucking build up and the waiting. Oh, does 43 boxes sound right? I'm gonna just wait for chat to tell me. Okay, that sounds good. Let's go. Die. Fucking kill me. Oh. Uh, hey, at least we know that if it's not 43 this time, I definitely missed one, right? It's Cash Vanuka. Oh, PBG. Hey, dude. Thank you for the 240 people 
being raided as a Banook. Oh no, where is it? <gasps> hey everybody from PBG Stream. My name is Jim, also known as Caddy, also known as Cad Icarus on YouTube. I've never said my name like that, Cad Icarus, not Cad Icarus, but either way, I, I don't mind what you call me. As long as you don't call me dickhead, I'm fine. Um, yeah, I play, I'm on YouTube, but also Twitch, and now I'm Twitch, your Twitch, everybody Twitch. Let's go. <gasps> that genuinely really scared me. It is Bandicoot month. It is, ban it is Bandicoot month. And because it's Bandicoot month, um, it's Bandicoot month because um, June is Bandicoot month. Because my birthday's in June. Crash 3 was the first game I ever played. Um, so, you know, just kind of makes sense. And Crash is one of my favorite franchises ever. So my birthday's in June. The first game I ever played was Crash. It, it, everything's June related when it comes to Crash and me. And um, I love I love Crash. So, uh, <laughs> PPG, wait, no dickhead. Good to know. You can call me dickhead if you want, PPG. I'm not going to complain about you calling me dickhead. In fact, you can call me dickhead and even do the hand motion. And maybe even if I'm feeling a bit cheeky, you could go up and down if you really want. But yeah, so um, ah! so because it's Bandicoot month, um, we are. Oh no, I hit I hit some nitro boxes, didn't I? So now we don't know if I have actually hit. Oh no, it's not going to be the same as last time, is it? Oh no. But anyway, I'm I'm getting going off track here. I'm going off track. Uh, um, yeah, so June is Bandicoot month for me. And because of that, every year, every June on my Twitch channel, we ha we have, we're going through a big quest to 100% and get every Platinum Time Trial Relic on every single Crash Bandicoot game if they have them. Uh, do you know what? I'm just going to... should be on 45. I am. Lasherus, what would I do without you? Thank you so much. But yeah, so... um. Uh, yeah, we've already done, if, if you couldn't tell from where we are with Wrath of Cortex at the moment on PS2, we have done Crash 1, the original, on PS1. Oh my god, I want to get this Aku Aku crate, I just want to be safe. There we go. Yeah, we've done the original Crash 1, the original Crash 2, the original Crash 3, and all of the Platinum Relics. Um, Crash Team Racing on PS1 with all the Platinum Relics. Crash Bash! 200%. There's no time trial relics in that game, but we, we did finish the whole fucking thing. Oh. I think that was a met. I think that I think we know where we went wrong. Hmm. And now we're doing 100% crash fall. As in Wrath of Cortex. I've got to go back to the fucking checkpoint again. That is a massive troll, isn't it? That is a massive troll -lo 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 because... Wait a second. I thought that was... Oh, sorry. Wait, 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 wait. Two deaths there. Wait, dead. And dead again. Yeah, that was a big troll because, first of all, I was under the impression that, um... Wait, I thought that the first metal crate was... What? So they want you to go around. Oh my god. All right, fair enough. Um, Game Master Anth, sorry. Thank you for the 12-month resub. Bandicoot month, time for Caddy. And one more year is cool too. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Um, LV Relaney, thank you for the sub. And Omega's Innocence, thank you for gifting five subs. Incredibly kind of you. But yeah, so not only is it hidden in the grass, but it's also timed and they want you to go around and back. Maybe I, that maybe that's where I missed it. Maybe that's where I missed it. I fucking hope that's where I missed it because I do not want to do this again. I'm just gonna try and get through this as quick as I can because this is this is not this is not the most fun. I, I won't lie, it's not the most fun. Damn it, went a bit too fast there. That's fine. That's fine. If there's one thing in life that you don't like. They're, they're, you can be many things in life. Being too fast is not one of the worst things you can be the worst at.
And the box count's looking good, but then why the f how the fuck would I know? I, I, I have literally no idea. Do you know what? I'm going to try a new method. I'm going to go down. That worked. Great. Cool. I didn't lose an Aku Aku. And he didn't lose me. We found each other. In Spain. And here's my story. Mamma mia. Here we go again. Oh, that was in Greece, wasn't it? It wasn't in fucking Spain. Oh, ignore me. Mamma mia, the musical. How I, how I learned to love myself and find Aku Aku. I can hear the ending portal. Please, God, tell me I got it right. Please. Please. Get in. Get in there. Get in. Good. Yes, mate. That's how we like to see it. Uh, excuse me. Uh, Blair Vich, thank you for the sub. Cool. Name. And five dollars from Singular Found Box. We've come full circle. Thank you so much. Oh, now I'm doing completely erect from Crash One, aren't I? No, he says. Thank you so much. Yeah, I will save. Thank you, Man 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 Manito San. Thank you. I will save the game. I've come too far to break on weathering heights of all levels. <laughs> okay, now should we creep? Should we creep over to the creep over to the save? Joins save game back on joins. Yes, there we go. Exit. Let's carry on. I also like. Going back to the visuals quickly, I actually really do like the aesthetic of the warp room here. I think it looks really cool. It looks really welcoming. Not used to the weather here, I a wimp. Wow, you've really got nothing to say. You really you don't have anything to say at all. You might as well just come in and you, you, you'll, you'll get one time you're gonna fly and screen and go, oh sorry, it was just me. I blew off, and then just then you're gone. Like you, you're saying nothing. You're adding nothing. You're threatening nothing. You're saying one pun and then fucking off. Oh, I don't know, guys. I don't know. Mek Sama, two hundred bits. Thank you so much. Finally got myself the chance to watch JoJo's Bizarre Adventure on Netflix. I love it. I haven't watched it. Um, Lasherus. Two dollars. Thank you so much. Is it too smug of me to be a little cocky about having given you the right um, crate count with the sub so you weren't completely stuck in uncertainty? No. You you have every right to be smug there, dude. You did great. Thank you. I just wanted to go to you equals one yay one more time before crashing into bed. Oh, thank you so much. No, no. Lasherus, I don't know what I would have done without you. I mean, to be honest, I, I, I wouldn't have known either way, so I would have just had to have gone through the level as best as I could. Do you know what? Now that I think about it, we are at the final level of World 4. I've just got the the, the Death Tornado spin. And aside from one, uh, like, absolutely, like, com oh, uh, aside from one necessary time where I had to use it on a bonus level, I haven't had any opportunities to even use it as a shortcut. I mean, now I'm starting to use it as a shortcut, but that's weird, isn't it? It's, yeah, it really does, like, this game wants to do... I feel like they made all the levels first, because they had all these ideas for stages. And they're not the worst designed things in the world, you know, they're competent. But then they were like, oh, fuck, now we're going to add in some shit from Crash 3 that people liked. And they just didn't think about how they would work into the levels that they'd already had ideas to make, I suppose. Wrathman, 200 bits, thank you. This is ridiculous. Who wants to play Crash at 3 in the morning? Oh boy, 3 a.m. I mean, I think the real question is who wants to play Wrath of Cortex at 3 in the morning? But, you know, welcome to my life. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, look. We've got invincibility on the, <laughs> on the monkey bars. Can I even reach this enemy before it runs out? Oh, yes. Great. Bravo, game. Thank you for that eight seconds of invincibility while I'm traveling at, a, like, two miles an hour, if that. I don't know why they're there. Probably for the time trials that you can jump off and then run and then jump back on. I'm not going to tempt fate. I'm going to go safe. 
There we go. Break that. There we go. Woo! Had he slowed down already? Okay, can I jump on top of the box? Yeah. Yep, thank you very much. That's what I needed you to do. Oh, God, here we go again. So the funny... Yeah. Yeah, no, that was fine. I don't know what I was actually going to say. That there's nothing funny. Ignore me. <laughs> Ign ignore me. <gasps> no! Okay, it's fine. I can, I can sacrifice a life. It's no big deal. <laughs> I've got plenty of them. I'm a gamer, you see. I have many. I don't have one life. I have many. I'm a gamer, you see. I have the t-shirt, you see. I have many lives. I'm a gamer, you see. Uh, there we go. Cool. I th in fact, I've actually used the... You know, I, I shat all over the sneak shoes earlier. And that's why they're leaving brown footprints. But I, sh I was shitting all over them earlier. But I've actually, I think, used them in more... What's the, what's the word when you have to use it? It's not necessary. Compulsory. I had to use it in a compulsory section. Like, I've had to use them in compulsory sections where I, I can't use anything else more times than, than the Death Tornado Spin Glide, and that's insane. And that would be fine if I got more use out of the Death Tornado Spin Glide, but the levels haven't been built around to be better shortcutted or whatever. Like, because they're all, they're all too compact and too... They're too linear in that sense. You can't really take any shortcuts or get through an enemy easier with the Death Tornado spin. It's just so weird. It's a, it's a mishmash of all these different... Oh, I don't know. It's a very strange game. It's a strange beast, this one. Okay. All right, let's get through this. But even, like, slide jumping. Slide jumping? I do that all the time in the classic crash games. Slide jumping? Haven't really fucking done it at all here. Haven't needed to. The, le the levels just haven't been built around the move set. They feel like they 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 feel like they were made a load of really difficult crash one levels and now yeah. There's just so much missed potential for getting more use out of how crash moves and unlocking powers that are actually useful and blah blah blah, you know. Please tell me I've got everything. Yeah. Fucking great. One. Yeah, Nico B, you're right. Traveller's Tales games are always a bit hit and miss. But then, like, yeah. I mean, what do you expect from a company that, like, ever since they founded, like, I still think Bugs Life on PS1 is a great game. Well, not great, but it's a really good game. I've got no problem with it. Um, It's got problems, but I've got no problem with it. <laughs> <laughs> can't talk but yeah i think once you start releasing things that critically or pop culturally are seen as just bad as a universal concept that is when um yeah that's that that's when like all the games that like the company make like they then they kind of get more half assed because it's like well the critics aren't gonna like it anyway so what's the point hey, look, I guess. the orange boy likes to fly <laughs> Time to earn your wings, kid. So Lolo had like, what, six, five lines of dialogue and all of them were shit. Emptiness, thanks for $3. Gamers don't die, we respawn. Yes, we do. Have you ever tried putting, take, having, look, next time you have a bath, get a, bring a toaster with you and then turn it, or put it, plug it in, make sure the power's on and then... Turn the toaster on while you're in the bath, and you'll see that you will come back with full health. Oh yes, you have to shoot him when on the arm, on the body part that's attacking. Right, I've completely forgot for a split second there. This is basically a slower and lamer version of the engine fight from Crash 3. 
The attacks can be pretty devastating, though. So, easier, I wouldn't say. I think it's easier... Like, it's easier to die, but not as easy to fuck up. Like, engine is pretty intense the whole way through. And this isn't as intense as engine by a long stretch. But, if you do get hit by any of the attacks, you will suffer greatly for it. Because they really hit like a truck. So it's it's kind of, it's it's decent. It's decently balanced in that sense. As a kid, I think this is where I I had to I had to stop playing the game for a while because as a kid I actually couldn't get past this bit and then I had to come back when I was a bit older. Which is funny because I was fine with engines, so I, I guess I don't know. Monkey bars, thank you for $3. Um can I read this while I'm fighting a boss? Let's find out. We are so sorry. We didn't. Uh, we didn't ask to get nerfed like this. I know. I know. It also. It's actually. Do you know what? It's actually kind of lame now that I'm looking at the fight. He's just doing the same attacks in the same loop. Yeah, he's just doing the. He's just doing the same. The same four or five attacks in the same order over and over again. No, this isn't a very good fight. <laughs> it's not the worst. It's not the best though. It's not that great. It could have been. It could. If there's anything you can say about Wrath of Cortex as a whole, it could have been shit, and it wasn't quite that. And that's as good as a compliment as most people are going to get, I think. Red Lemon Boy, thank you for 200 bits. Back on the hand? Yep. Yeah, there's just it's just not very kinetic. There's not much going on in this arena. It's not very exciting. It's pretty slow and ploddy. I don't know. This is a weird fight. And then what do you expect from the mask that had, like, five lines? I mean, it wasn't exactly going to be good, was it? Oh, fuck. I wasn't paying attention. I was looking at the... Shit. But, yeah, so that took off 20% of my health right there. So, yeah, if you fuck up, you, you do get punished for it. It's just... It's quite easy to not fuck up. I'll read, I'll read the supporting everything in a second. Can I do that? Red Lemon Boy, thank you for 200 bits. Hey, Caddy, I recently 100%ed completed Crash 2 after two years of on and off playing. As a side note, I honestly prefer the original PS1 versions of Crash 2 and 3 to the remasters because I find I find the old looks and game feel. That's fine. Yeah. I just think Insane Trilogy as a video game is just fucking great. Like, it's it's one of my favorites. Like, would I, if I had to pick an individual game, would I pick Crash 3 or Insane? Obviously, Insane, because it's three games in one, and they're all fantastic as, as remasters, so, yeah. And it takes forever as well. <laughs> and you don't get any satisfaction from hitting him, because, like, there's no feedback on the controller or any noises. It's just he flashes in, a, in an X-ray pattern. It doesn't mean anything. It's not like Engine where, like, everything, like, rattles and shakes and breaks and blows up, like... Yeah, that, that, I mean, it could have been worse, but it's not a very good fight. We have got now the Fruit Bazooka. Fan-fucking-tastic. Fan-tabby-tooby. I don't think I got past Wawa. L lots of people didn't, which I found out from the last stream, which surprises me. It really does surprise me. Um, before I sign off... I mean, it's already 10 past 3. I might as well go for that, um... No, no, I'll start the next stream off because I've only got one more world to do and then I've got some relics and then the secret world. So, I will do that all next time. I am really tired. Let's find somebody to raid, shall we? And then we will raid them. Um... Uh... Oh! Digimanda, oh bless her. Digimanda is a is a very, very sweet streaming lady. Yes, I will save. Don't worry, I'll save once I type in the I'll save once I type in the raid command. Don't you worry, guys. You know what? I have to reboot my, my keyboard anyway, so I'll go and save now while that's doing that. But we're going to be raiding tonight Digimanda, who is a sweetheart. Um, and she's a teacher, so automatically you should respect her just on that principle alone. Um She's very much in the crowd with Ant Dude and Foosh, who are a couple. Um, I don't know if she VTubes. Oh, no, she doesn't VTube. She's, she's got a camera. But she's playing Kingdom Hearts 1. And it says, she says first-ish playthrough. 
which is interesting. Um, I'm always down for watching someone's first reactions to fucking Kingdom Hearts. So I am definitely going to raid Digimon. And she's only got 32 people watching her. So 962 here. I think she'd appreciate the company. So there we go. Yeah. So um, I'm going to hang out with um, with Digimanda and I was just going to download the stream and pack up and blah, blah, blah. But in the meantime, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Thanks for joining in with these train wrecks of streams. Um, and yeah, thanks for all the support. Thanks for all the love. It really means the world to me. I will see you whenever I see you. I'm not going to say when because I can't promise anything, but I'll see you, I'm pretty sure, very soon. Thanks very much, everybody. Oh. Next, $4 just to close off. In addition to the 25 death, here's for the rest of the deaths. Thank you so much, dude. Really kind of you. I will see you all very soon. Bye-bye, everybody.